So in 2018, I won Arden Classic in Columbus, Ohio. Europe's strongest man, Iceland's strongest man, the world's strongest man, and the world's ultimate strongman. Last year was good, yeah, for sure. Adding my fourth Arnold title is, I would have to say, the most important thing to me. Right now, it's feeling good. Body's feeling strong and healthy, and that's half of the battle in a lot of ways. So if I can walk in there feeling like this, hit my peak right, it's going to be really good. You always got something that's bugging you, you know, hamstrings back, lats are beat up from Saturday. It's just a typical Monday. This is why we do this day in and day out and train the way we do and make the sacrifices we do is to make those giant lifts on stage. Deadlift is, is big this year. Rogue has thrown out a challenge for anybody that can lift over 500 kilos, which is 1,103 pounds, roughly. Rogue is offered $50,000 on it, which is huge. So I think some, like a lot of guys will focus on the deadlift in the next couple of months. We'll do about four different variations of deadlift between the racks, regular floor. To me, too, the elephant bar is a different animal. It reacts to different weights. Yeah. You know, so that'll be the thing is, what's it gonna do at 1,100 pounds? You know, I know at 1,000 pounds it changes, you know, from what it is at 900 pounds. That's awesome, we still got, still got the blood on it from last year. <laughs> I think it's a good bar to train for the elephant uh, bar deadlift. Obviously, I would love to have one of the elephant bars to duplicate it even closer, but I think it's a good way to train. It's a huge mark to raise the established record by 60 pounds, but there's a few of us that are crazy enough to go after it. There's a big prize on it if you can get it, but it's a big risk as well, you know. You could risk putting yourself out of the rest of the show and maybe out for the rest of the year. There are at least four guys going to the Arnold that can pull more than a thousand pounds. Myself, Hofthor, Jerry Pritchett, and JF Crone. And I think out of those four, one of us is gonna have the best opportunity to actually lift that weight. Jerry Pritchett, I believe if he comes in a good shape and uh, stays injury free. Come on, Jerry Pritchett, let's break this world record. You know, he set the record at 1,031. He lifted that weight really well. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He could have more than that in the tank and potentially give a really good run at the 1,100. And then, of course, uh, Brian Shaw. The way that I'm training, the way that I'm preparing, mentally getting ready, is to give that my best attempt. I think those two will be my biggest threat. You know, and the world record breaker, 501 kilo deadlift challenge, I think Hofthor I think he's gonna do well. Obviously, he's coming off a big pull last year where he felt really good and, you know, it was, it was a great lift at 1,041, set the new record with that weight. Most of us going into this year will be looking at beating Hofthor's record at the 1041, at going 1045, 1050, 1060, but now we're looking 60 pounds past that, which is, is huge. You wouldn't hear somebody go to a racetrack and say, yeah, you're gonna knock, you know, five seconds off the track record tonight, you know. They laugh at you. 
They tell us, oh, you're gonna try to put 60 pounds on the current record, but there's 50 grand on it. Okay, we'll try it. <laughs> it's a well-paid event. Guys are gonna seriously go for it. It's almost as much as the first place win. So, you know, guys will go for it, you know, for sure. You know, you're able to make history with this one lift. That's maybe even more important than, than just winning the prize money. Like each year at the Arnold, I think Terry Todd started that by raising the mark, you know, every year through the years. You know, whether Yoke went from 1,000 pounds and worked his way to over 1,500, or Log has worked his way to 450, or whatever it's been, the bar has always been risen. And the 2019 Arnold Strongman Classic will definitely be one for the record books. One of the best qualities you can have as, as a, a competitive strongman is to bring your best performance on the day. You know, and so when it matters, you step up and you can do stuff that maybe you couldn't do in training. I want my best lift to come on the day in the contest when it matters. The level of strongman is, is growing. The guys are getting stronger, but so am I. I honestly believe that I will have a good shot at that record.